But we don't have guarantees that phases two and three are going to create economic sustainability and quality health care for the array of people that are covered by the Affordable Care Act. People already suffer and they take the risk not to buy insurance knowing that it'll be expensive if they have some sort of catastrophic health event that requires them to spend. 30% additional is not enough of an incentive, so there's got to be something stronger to get people to buy insurance when they're healthy. You're hearing from these U.S. senators who are very strong on economics and understand what is necessary to create a sustainable health care system. I think that the U.S. Senate could be a very moderate influence that creates a system that is sustainable if they can get their hands on this bill.